Sharan and Mayuk working together can complete a task in 18 days. However, Mayuk works alone and leaves after completing one third of the task. Then Sharan takes over and completes the remaining work by himself. As a result, the duo could complete the work in task in 40 days. How many days would Sharan alone have taken to do the job if Mayuk had worked faster than Sharan? Interesting question. So what do we know? We know Sharan and Mayuk together can do a job in 18 days. Yes. However, Mayuk starts alone. He does one third of the task. And then Sharan takes over and completes the remaining work. Remaining work is what? Two thirds of the work. As a result, they took 40 days. So when they work together, they can do in 18 days. But Mayuk did one third, Sharan did two thirds, they took 40 days. So how many days will Sharan alone take to finish the job if Mayuk had worked faster than Sharan? So basically, among these two guys, Mayuk and Sharan, Mayuk works faster than Sharan. Mayuk's capacity is higher than Sharan's capacity. So if that is the case, then how many days would Sharan alone take if he has to do the job? Simple, let's assume Sharan takes S days to do the job alone and Mayuk takes M days to do the job alone. Now, according to the first statement, Sharan and Mayuk working together complete the task in 18 days, which means what? Which means what? 1 by S plus 1 by M equals to 18. Or, or simply I can say uh, SM by S plus M equals to 18. Yes or no? You know the shortcut, right? Formula. When two persons are working together, the number of days required is AB by A plus B. So SM by S plus M equals to 18. Yeah? So this is one equation that we have. The other equation that we have is about the actual case. Sharan did one third, Mayuk did one third and Sharan did two thirds. So understand and together they have taken 40 days. So can I say that if, if she, Sharan alone will take S days, if he has done one third of the work, he will take, sorry, Mayuk alone takes M days. But if he has done one third of the work, he will take M by three days. Yes or no? Alone he takes M days. So to do one third of the work, he will take M by three days. Likewise, Sharan alone takes S days to do the full work. But if he has done two third of the work, he will take only two S by three days. Number of days and number of work are proportional to each other, right? I mean, total if he takes M days alone to do one third of the work, he'll take one third of the M days. Total if he takes S days alone to do the work, to do two third of the work, he'll take two by three S days. And this together is equal to 40. Yes or no? These two together is equal to 40. Right? Number of days taken by Mayuk alone for doing one third of the work plus number of days taken by Sharan alone to do two thirds of the work is equal to 40 and together they do 18 and 18 days. Solve two equations, two variables. This is equation number one. This is equation number two. Solve those two equations. You'll get S and M. Try it out. What happens? Simplify this. So can we say M plus 2S equals to 43 is 120. Simplify this now. What do we get from this one? SM equals to 18S plus 18M. Solving these equations is going to be the real calculation part which we have to work on. Mm. For example, let's say, what can I do here? If I take M common, it is S minus 18 equals to 18S. Or I can say M is equal to 18S by S minus 18. Yes or no? SM minus 18M, S minus 18, so M equals to 18S by S minus 18. That's it. Put this M now in this place. See what happens. So 18S by S minus 18 plus 2S equals to 120. Simplify this quadratic equation. So 18S plus 2S into S minus 18 equals to 120 into s minus 18. Mm. So 2s squared, 2s into s, 2s squared, 18s minus of 18 into s, so minus 18s, 18s minus 36x, so minus 18s equals to 120s minus 120 into 18. Yeah, I think I can I can stop here. Now all you have to do is solve for this quadratic equation to get the value of s. You will probably get two values of s. Based on those two values of s, you will get two values of m. Because m is equal to whatever 18s minus uh, 18s by s minus 18, right? 
Now, what you know is Mayuk works faster than Sharon, right? So Mayuk should take less number of days when compared to Sharon. So based on those two values, you can eliminate the one. In one case, you'll probably find S more than M. In the other case, you'll find S less than M. So wherever is M less than S should be the answer because Mayuk M works faster than Sharon. Uh, let me solve this. So basically, uh, what happens? This is if I take minus one uh, one twenty s on the other side, we get two s squared minus one thirty eight s plus one twenty into eighteen. Yeah. Solve this now. So this is 69, this is 16 to 18. Yeah, getting the roots is the challenge there, but surely you can do that. S squared minus 69S plus 618 is 108. So 10808 equals to 0. So how can we break this? S squared minus 691080. Mm. 1080 I think is a multiple of I'm just doing that calculation mentally right 1080 how do you break it 90 it's a multiple of 90 90 into 12 90 minus 21 9 minus 90 plus 21 no that doesn't help 45 into 24 45, 24, 69. Yes. So I think the. We do I do now next step. It's running out of space already. Shall I do it here? Sorry for the congestion. Yeah. So what do we have? S squared. I'll say minus 45s minus 24s plus 1080 equals to 0. So s into s minus 45. Minus 24, if you say, it will again be s minus 45. Because 24 into 45 is 1080. So what are the values of S? Sorry. What are the values of S? Sorry. Yeah, so from this we can conclude. Just a S is either 45 or 24. Hmm? S is equal to either 45 or 24. S is 45 or 24. Now put that here. So M will be equal to what? 18 into 45 by 45 minus 18 is 27, right? You, you, you're getting it. So let's say S is equal to 45. M will be equal to 18 into 45 by 45 minus 18. 45 minus 18 is 27. So this is 3 times, this is 2 times 15. So M comes out to be 30. M is equal to 30. So S45, M30. Mayuk had work faster than Sharon, right? Looks like correct. Mayuk can do it in 30 days. Sharon can do it in 45 days. So I can say then Sharon will only take 45 days. Right? If, if you take SS24, then what happens? Again, if you take SS24, if S is equal to 24, then M will be equal to what? then m will be equal to 18 into 24 by 24 minus 18 is 6 24 minus 18 so this is 6 right 6 into 1 6 into 3 m comes out to be 72 so see look at this now s is 24 m is 72 but we know that mayu had worked faster than sharon so can mayu take more than this more days than sharon no so this is wrong s being 24 is wrong s cannot be 24 s cannot be 24 s has to be 45 so Sharon alone can do it in 45 days. 45 days is the answer. Now, so more, what is important is the equations here. Equation number one, AB by A plus B equals to 18 and equation number two, number of days taken by Mayuk alone plus number of days taken by Sharon alone for the respective works should be equal to total number of days 40. So all these two equations to get the answer. But to my original point, if options are given, all this drama is not required. 